In order to not miss important videos from us, subscribe on our channel and ring the notification bell in the button below this video. Hello everyone. In this video you will learn the differences between the Northern Hemisphere and the Southern Hemisphere. They have many differences between them, which are only known from the people that study this field. The pole is a central point of one of the opposite sides of the globe. Both South and North Hemisphere have such a center. The equator represents the zero point and divides the North from the South. Northern Hemisphere the Northern Hemisphere is called the spherical part of the Earth, which is located in the northern part of the equator. Astronomical summer in the north lasts from June to August, while winter from December to February. The Northern Hemisphere has far more terrestrial surfaces than the southern one and is therefore also called the Earth Hemisphere. The Northern Hemisphere continents are Asia except Indonesia, which mainly lies in the Southern Hemisphere, Europe, North America, a small part of South America, about two-third of Africa. Southern Hemisphere The Southern Hemisphere represents the Earth's land that lies to the south of the equator. In the Southern Hemisphere, there are five continents, Antarctica, Australia, the largest part of South America, parts of Africa and Asia. The two poles are at the extremes of our planet. Many of their features are extremely opposite. Let's now see their top 10 differences. 1. Metamorphosis the Arctic area is located in the North Pole region and has a natural melting cycle, during which almost half the amount of ice melts in summer and freezes again in winter. On the other hand, the Antarctic area in the South Pole has almost the same size and shape of ice over the 12 months of the year. The Arctic region melts faster because it is immersed and the ocean accelerates the process, while the Antarctic region which has many rocks, is not affected by this phenomena. 2. Ozone Layer Hole over the Antarctic region there is a hole in the ozone layer, which is now almost three times bigger than the one over the U.S. surface. While the ozone layer over the North Pole has no cracks, the term ozone hole is used to describe the phenomenon through which chemical substances, ozone, is damaged in some places. 3. Cold and very cold. The South Pole is far colder than the North Pole. Currently, the temperatures in South are so low that snow does not melt in some parts of the continent. The average annual temperature is minus 49 degrees Celsius, which makes the South Pole the coldest place in the world. While the average temperature during the winter season in the North Pole is minus 34 degrees Celsius, it rises during the summer season. The lowest temperature ever recorded on Earth was minus 89.6 degrees Celsius and is reported by the Vostok base, near the South Pole. 4. Polar Bears and Penguins Most people believe that polar bears and penguins live in the same environment. In fact, this false idea has its roots in television commercials and postcards. Penguins live only in the Southern Hemisphere and have no natural continental ancestors. Polar bears are in fact endemic species living in the Northern Hemisphere. They feed themselves with seals, sea cows and sometimes whales. 5. The Black Gold According to published estimates, almost half of the remaining oil deposits are found beneath the ice of the northern part of the Arctic region. It is thought that oil deposits are also found in the south region, but the Antarctic Treaty stops strictly any activity that exploits the oil. 6. No one's Earth Despite the symbolic images of explorers who raise flags on South Pole ice, the Antarctic continent is the only country on Earth that does not belong to anyone. By contrast, more than 4 million people live in the North Pole. We mention villages and towns like Barrow, Alaska, Tromsø, Norway, Murmansk and Selkhurd, Russia. 7. Ice everywhere. The southernmost continent of the planet, Antarctica, carries 90% of Earth's ice. Apparently, the North Pole has much less ice than the South Pole. 8. Continent Ocean. The North Pole, said simply, is a frozen ocean. Otherwise, Antarctica is a continent, set on rocks and Earth formations valleys and lakes, surrounded by the ocean. In fact, Antarctica is home to the most active volcano, Mount Erebus. The Arctic region that has only ice, is the place where the interests of many countries are concentrated. Canada, Greenland, Russia, Iceland, Norway, Sweden, Finland and the United States. 9. Polar Vortex An interesting phenomenon that occurs on Earth poles is the polar vortex, which is a massive cyclone formed near the vertical edges of the planet. Polar vortexes occur in the medium and upper layers of the troposphere and stratosphere. 10. The magnetic field and mineral deposits. Since Antarctica is a mass of land, there are many minerals, gold, silver, platinum, iron, etc. In the North Pole, there are no such minerals. 
When we talk about the Earth's magnetic poles, we refer to the geographic area of the same name. Although the North Pole's magnetic field is located in the South, while the South Pole's magnetic field is located in the North. For this reason, the compass does not indicate the magnetic North, but the geographical North of the planet. You have now learned the top 10 differences between the North and South Pole. If you want to share any information about this topic with us or want to suggest us a new topic, you can do that in the comments section below. Subscribe on our channel for more videos and share this video with the world. Thank you for watching.